Now the Hoffman Tactical Super Safety is a forced reset device, but it also utilizes that bottom shelf of the bolt carrier. So with the safety selector in full auto, trigger is pulled, the trigger sear lets go of the hammer and the hammer falls, the weapon is fired. Now as long as you hold the trigger back, that sear will not engage the hammer, letting the hammer to keep getting tripped by the full auto sear in the back. And how that happens is when the bolt carrier moves to the rear and cocks the hammer, the safety selector has disengaged the disconnector. So the disconnector cannot grab the hammer. But that little second hook at the tail of the hammer that's not on a semi-automatic hammer is what catches the full auto sear. And when the bolt carrier moves forward, when that shelf on the bottom of the bolt carrier hits the top of the full auto sear, the full auto sear rotates and lets go of the hammer. So when the bolt carrier goes in full battery, the hammer will be let go and another round will be fired. And as long as you hold that trigger back, disengaging that first trigger sear, the weapon will fire until all rounds have been expended.